And a Port Isabel High School student is being celebrated tonight. Her act of heroism in the school's cafeteria saving another student's life. CBS 4's Joe DeLeon has the story. Congratulations. Thank you. Desiree Vidotti is a sophomore at Port Isabel High School. At a Point Isabel school board meeting, Desiree was celebrated as the district's first tarpon spotlight recipient. No one really knew that she was choking, but um, she started coughing and just kind of like grabbing her chest. So I just automatically, you know, got up and I performed the Heimlich maneuver. Desiree and her friends were having a typical lunch on November 17th when she noticed one of her friends was struggling to breathe. Without hesitation, Desiree sprung into action and performed the Heimlich maneuver, something she says her parents taught her for situations just like this. My mom's a teacher and my dad's a fishing captain, so they're both certified to do those kind of things. So they've always brought it to our attention just in case of certain situations like this. Her act of heroism performed brought to the attention of administrators who say this could have ended up differently had Desiree not intervened. We could have been talking about a different story and, and I'm glad that we're in the news and being show, showcasing this student for her, her being a hero than, you know, talking about a sad story in our community. Point Isabel Superintendent Teresa Capistran says this life-saving maneuver is something that could soon be taught to all students. We know that this Heimlich maneuver is so important and we are definitely going to be embedding this for all of our students, no different than what Desiree was able to do and save a life for one of our very own Tarpon students. Desiree's glad her quick action saved her friend and is glad she could help. She was very thankful. She thanked me a lot. Um, and she was just very appreciative because, you know, it was a scary moment for her. Working for you in Port Isabel, Joe DeLeon.